bacteria were here on this planet long before we were, and they'll be here long after we're gone. Yet we still think that we can control and eliminate them at our whim. Let's think about where that could lead. Do you want to live in a world where there's no more laser eye surgeries, no more tonsillectomies, no more tooth extractions, no more vasectomies, no more ACL repairs? Of course not. Neither do I. But that's the world that we're moving toward. And I'll tell you why. Overuse of antibiotics. We're going to reach a point where the only surgeries that we can perform are those where the stakes are life or death. Everything else gets ruled out because once bacterial resistance overcomes antibiotics entirely, we can't risk routine surgeries anymore. Instead of looking at pathogenic bacteria as a problem to eliminate, what if we changed their behavior and took away their ability to cause disease? We will never overcome bacterial resistance, but perhaps we can embrace it and turn it to our advantage. What if we studied bacterial populations to provide humanity with the tools to combat the antibiotic resistance crisis and treated pathogenic bacteria not as something to destroy, but as something to modify and recruit to work in our favor? What if we embraced resistance by forcing bacteria to make a choice? Either succumb to our therapy or gain resistance by giving up the ability to cause disease. When we think of bacteria as potential agents of health, we can start to tackle the antibiotic resistance crisis. Thank you.